The tapes are now mandatory viewing for anyone who's getting into psychological profiling. And they're also the centerpiece of the courses I teach on the subject. If I've learned one thing from teaching this class, it's this. After what we're going to see here today, three of you will go home tonight and decide that this is not what you want with your life. You know, there are some terrible people in this world who do unbelievably terrible things. So it's important that each of you ask yourself, do I really want to surround myself with these terrible things for the rest of my professional life? And it's okay if you don't. This is nothing. He doesn't even know what he's doing yet. I mean, his car is parked alongside the road. He knows where the next gas station is. He knows that it's only a mile or two off the freeway. And he knows that it's a desolate area between the freeway and the gas station. In fact, the station is abandoned. And I bet he knows that too. And he had a ready-made excuse for the camera. Which brings me to another point. Leaving the work at work. I know you see something like this, and it's hard to get it out of your head, but you have to. When I was seven, my little sister disappeared and was never found. And uh, it destroyed but it had been a very happy family until then. And I swore that I would hunt down those kinds of bastards that steal little girls. And the reason why I teach today is because I couldn't leave my work at work. You know, there were some people who considered me the best profiler that was, and I pushed it too far. I had a complete mental and emotional breakdown, leaving me briefly institutionalized. Now look, I'm not telling you this so you'll feel sorry for me or anything like that. I'm telling you this because it, it is a very real risk with this job. You can't be thinking about Jennifer Gorman when your little daughter is outside playing in the yard. You need to find a way to leave your work at work. Okay? Second body in the woods behind a place called the Red House Tavern, about three miles away. But the thing to keep in mind is this. He signed this before he even met the Andersons. 